So here we go, the final act in what has been a, a competition that has entranced us throughout. Never short on drama or emotion or talking points. This year's edition certainly does more than hold up to its predecessors. It seems this is the game in which everybody is keen to play a part. The stands are washed with colour, proud renditions of their songs from either end. It really does have all the ingredients of a top, top final. It is a venue this which simply adds to the spectacle of the game it stages. One of the most impressive arenas in this part of the world. It does have a distinctive feel. Teams, Jim, eyeing the ultimate prize here. Unerring focus and determination in all of those eyes. Yes, Peter, I've been a, a winning finalist and I've been a, a losing finalist and I don't need to tell anyone what I prefer. Winning will help fans remember you for a long, long time. So I sincerely wish both teams well and hope that all the players can give a good account of themselves and, and you've heard it before, may the best team do it. Final gets on the way. Look, we can only hope for a final that will be real chance. Goal! We have lift off at the final. The big star, the perfect start. Oh, what an opening! An absolutely fantastic opening to this final, and we shouldn't be surprised that it's a player with a terrific track record too. Come at the hour, come at the man. I think we've got lift off. What about that, Jim Beglin? Yeah, I really can't say enough as to how good the final ball was. It took the defence out of the equation for that split moment, and the damage was all done. Liverpool take the lead, landing the first significant blow in what is certainly a significant contest. Well, Peter, the emphasis should now switch to winning it, rather than even thinking about losing it. And it's been taken straight back. Good challenge, he just stood firm. Konate. Oxlade Chamberlain. And it's been intercepted, and that will come to nothing. We sit high. Mohamed Salah finds himself offside. Courtois gets it upfield. And back to base. Konate. Just to point out, Peter, that the fullbacks are quite high. And what do they try to achieve? Well, it's obviously a move to push um, the opposition wide men back and, and give them more to think about. 
Robertson drives it forward. Modric. There has been just the early goal here, and it's 1 0. Valverde. Vinicius Junior. Alexander Arnold gets his foot in there. Dicks one in. Questions were asked, and he's given the answers. He's got away. Got a sight of goal here. Mane. Mane with a shot! And for a moment, time stood still. A chance that's created through very good grafting. Did well to get in the face of his opponent. And here's Marco Asensio, just brushed off the ball there. Van Dijk demonstrating fabulous determination, he just will not be beaten. Oxlade-Chamberlain. Vallejo gets into the right position to intercept. Vinicius Junior can't get the better of his opposite number. Oh, good interception. Keeper's got good distance on that. Tries to dink it in. He's got through. Goes for goal! Oh, he's managed to get it all wrong. Yeah, that's great running from the way he maneuvered himself in such a good position to receive the pass and go through on the goalkeeper then. Fabinho. Done very well to intervene. Now it's Mohamed Salah going through. Mohamed Salah. Here's the cross. Great leap! A lovely header, but really it was all about the delivery. Yeah, I just thought he wanted that more than anyone else on the pitch, and it was fully deserved. He gave it everything he had. Liverpool have a couple of goals without reply, it's 2-0. Well, that second goal has given them so much more command and confidence now, and they should be able to take it on from here and either add to their lead or, or close it out. Surely they'll manage one or the other. Vinicius Junior. And it's played forward. Now it's Mane. He's left his man. Room for a shot, and the shots! Oh, the keeper's done ever so well. Well, you can't ask for much more than that. A difficult moment he simply had to deal with. This possibly the last play of the half. And the header! And there's the whistle. The first half of the final has flown by. First 45 minutes of the final, Jim. Looking for you. Liverpool have the lead, and obviously.
obviously it's going to be the happy dressing room at half time, but it'll be interesting to see what they do second half. I really think that they should push on and do more of what we saw as we approached half time. Liverpool sitting pretty here at half time, 2 0 up. So we're already into the second period. Benzema! This could fall anywhere. Alexander Arnold gets rid without sophistication. Modric gets it back. Diaz. Keita. Could be a small day day! And it's Marcelo. Oh, that's a foul, and the whistle's gone. And that's going to be a booking. Modric. That's our gets on the end of it. Oh, shooting chance! Oh, denied brilliantly. Well, what can I say? Truly wonderful goalkeeping. Great reactions in front of goal. He just saw what was on. Our oh, players like this fella almost have a sixth sense to get themselves in such great coaching positions. How quick minded was that? This is threatening to become a really good game. Well, I think they probably needed an early goal in this half just to give them the confidence and belief to push on and look for an equaliser. Liverpool making a fresh attempt to release someone in behind from back to front, and this is something different. Vinicius Junior. Benzema, he's gone for it! And he's found the net! Well, I think there's a few trying to claim offside, but he looks to have been on. Yeah, he was on. Liverpool are able now to make their substitution. It's been on the cards for uh, a few moments now. We have ourselves a real game here. No doubt as to who has the momentum here now. The only doubt is how many is coming. Hoists it forward. Hit into the middle. And he's cut it out. Marcelo loses his balance and loses the ball. Thiago tries lifting it over. It's a goal kick. It's a long ball. 
and it's not hit its target. Vinicius Junior! He's got away with one there. Activity in the box means it's hard not to pick someone in. It's pretty clear that he's being singled out. Yeah, and the fact that he's registered, Peter, simply encourages more attention of, um, of a, a closer nature. Oh, real danger here! Things in across. Real Madrid showing a good level of intensity at this stage. They're calling on all their resources now. Casemiro. Courtois sends that a long way. Alexander Arnold. With a definite fell there. Alexander Arnold is off, and the boss has some thinking to do now. So here comes the substitution. Yeah, it's pretty obvious as to who was going to be taken off. His energy levels began to, to sag, and he was never going to last until the final whistle. Fabinho cuts it out. Real Madrid merit full marks for their attitude and application in trying to win this. It means an awful lot, obviously. Needed to be better there, it's a wasted chance. Vallejo drives it forward. Well, both sides might have to settle for a draw here, although there's still a chance for one last fling. Daniel Carvajal, Casemiro. Well played, he saw that coming. You wonder if that's it now, but there may be one more opportunity, Peter, for a late, late steal here. The sense it in a good position. Real Madrid are making a change now. Yeah, he's run himself into the ground, hasn't he? And it's, it's good to see that the crowd appreciate his efforts because he has put in a real honest shift. position to make that interception. Fabinho goes looking. Oh, he's managed to get himself offside. A couple of changes then in quick succession. Well, he's worked so hard for his side, uh, as you would expect, but couldn't help notice that he was starting to to labor a bit so it's no surprise nothing to separate them we have extra time and it's been a contest between two sides that were evenly matched on the day neither deserves to be on the losing side so 90 minutes could produce a winner and we have extra time
And here we go then. Mohamed Salah has given away a free kick. Liverpool have turned to their bench and we're going to have a substitution. Well, the ball's come loose and the chase is on. Hazard. Hazard. He's had a goal! Oh, just lacked a decent finish. Do I really need to tell you, Peter, that he has to do better, especially from there? Robertson. Now it's Henderson. Good ball. It'll be a throw in. <laughs> Timely intervention. Forward it goes. Oh, no question, that's a foul. Marcelo set up one goal so far. Mane goes up and over to the keeper and go again. And we're off and running. The last 15 minutes, the closing stretch of a marathon final. And it's Firmino. He's on his way. Firmino. Big chance! And somehow he managed to miss it. Firmino has delivered a really costly miss. It could have been their last chance to win it. about that I think they perfected that on the training ground because it took them seconds to get the ball from back to front and they really commit forward in numbers too it was all very well drilled Real Madrid take the lead. That just goes to underline why they're in this position. The ability to grind out results. Shot a goal! It's anyone's ball. Plays it back. Oh, man, he sorted that out. Liverpool need to give it everything they have, kitchen sink included. 
He's just by a hole. Well, that's where he wants it. And Dyke. And Dyke plays it forward. Doesn't get the pass he's looking for. The final whistle and the end. There was to be no perfect ending. They were brave, but they fell short. Well, these are the moments seared forever painfully on the memory of fans and players. After a campaign of so many highs and lows, the glory has got away. Yeah, and most of these players may never get this close again. It may